sociology exam on Thursday. Oh, okay. Was, um, I felt like I knew what I was doing. Multiple choice? Multiple, choice? multiple yes. Yeah. <laughs> That's how we like it. What about you? Oh, management skills is multiple choice. <laughs> oh, is it? <laughs> I hope so. I had no idea. Wait, did you talk? Wait, do you talk Hamilton? Yeah. Yeah? It's so easy. I got one wrong on my exam. Yeah. Last Thank semester. Thank you. A, yeah, I got A. Yeah. But like honestly, like it's not even a big deal because I think a lot of people got A's in our class. Yeah. But um so I'm not the team. Have to like choose someone else. Hey Nick, what's up? It's cool. How was your weekend? A Russian ball. Yeah, my girlfriend's Russian, so I had to go to some ball thing for her. Um, I guess. And I have to leave. That's why I'm late. We were talking about how she's at the team. I'm not the team leader, so we're gonna have to choose someone else. So, anyone down to do it? You? Alright. Go ahead. Oh, am I team leader? Your team. <laughs> yeah, you're team leader now. Nick, I think you're gonna have to, like, sit in the middle. Because you're, like, not in the frame. That's better. So we're going to have this video going on for like 20 to 30 minutes. Um, you guys want to start with what we did last time? Okay. Just like go over what we yeah, did? Yeah, go over it. Well, we interviewed the manager. And we yeah, you guys went right after that. Yeah. Like the yeah. We like realized that they have an output problem of just like being very not strict, which makes like the employees like not motivated to come in and like more motivated to forget that word. Like call out of work. Like that's a big problem. Well we all just like that right now. Right? Yeah. And then what else did we do? Um everything to advise them not being so strict when they call out. They got to feel like they're a little bit interested in people, I guess you could say and they have so many Like they thought of them as a friend first rather than a manager, which is just like So the respect aspect. The respect aspect is really there. <laughs> because <laughs> you wanna repeat what he said just in case? No, I think I think he did. I think yeah. But like I just think that like if they like I know that like as like a manager you want like everyone to like you, right? But like at the same time, you're a manager for a reason. Like, you're not there to like make friends. Like, you should be the one that's like telling people to do and whatever. So like, I feel like that's if we were gonna do anything, we should directly work with the managers. Yeah. Because everything depends on them. Yeah. Is that all we discussed last week? Um, we had our survey. I'm 
I'm excited to go back. I want bubble tea really badly. Honestly, the bubble tea there is pretty bomb. Yeah. The one that you got us was really good. Yeah, it's my first time ever had. What? Really? Yeah. I think you've never had bubble tea before. Have you? Nope. Oh my god. I think we should just take a whole class there. Oh my god. Because like they're all students, so you know? most, most like the audio that I do is more for the students. Yeah. Don't need them like too many hours. So I'm not surprised that like they think that their work schedule is flexible. It's just the fact that like I feel like it's too flexible. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, it's like oh, yeah. yeah. And like I like from like our surveys before, like I know that the employees aren't happy with how like. Some of them are really happy because they're the ones that like take off a lot. But then there are other employees that like have to like compensate for like the work that's like missing, you know, like not missing. Yeah. And like that like creates like so like if all the people that like really valued their jobs quit, then it would all be all the people that like don't really care and like that like want flexible schedules, you know what I mean? So like
a good aspect of home PT is that like they are flexible with student schedules, like especially like midterms coming up. Like if someone told me to take a shift, I'd be like, uh, yeah. I feel like school comes first. I feel like that's an aspect that we should keep. But at the same time, I feel like they should be responsible for their shifts. Like they can't just like call out the day before and be like, hey, sorry, I have a midterm. Like you should have known about that midterm since the beginning of the semester. Like if you're gonna, like you know, like if you're gonna do that, then like you should give me a notice. Like at least like a week, so that I can like, so like as a manager, like I would be able to find someone to do that, yeah. to like take your shift. Anyway. I used to work at Olive Garden, and like, if I was gonna call out, like, because like the only reason why I would ever call out is because like I was sick, and if I was sick, then I would have to get a doctor's note. Yeah, and then if I if I wanted time off, I had to request it like two weeks in, in advance, and like give them a reason why, and then like a week before they would like tell me if I could go, if I have the time off. And like, what else did I do? I think I was sick. Like, I think I was just sick. Yeah, those were like basically like, but like that helped. That honestly like motivated me more to go into work because I didn't want to. First of all, I didn't want to lose my job. But and like I knew that my managers weren't gonna like take my like crap. Oh, they weren't gonna take my crap and like let me do whatever I want. So like basically. I feel like something like that would be like good for me. Oh, and if I wanted to take a day off, I had to like go on this like website and like like ship with someone. Yeah. Be like, hey guys, like I have an open ship, like can someone like please cover this? Yeah. yeah. So it's you should like make up like trade like like oh I'll cover your ship. Like they should do that too. Yeah. Like they should make up for like if they cancel last minute, like if they have to and it's like an emergency, they should definitely be like, I'll cover someone else's like something like
and like the sh like shift problem, like switching shifts, I feel like that would be like like it would be better handled because they'd be more willing to like like shift with their friends, and then. So it would, be, it would just be like a better environment for them to work in. Yeah. They're like, their management team is really like fun. Like we're a team and there's like a leader and we can make it all the time. And like, we have a lenient so like we don't have like a business to run. So we should like relate that to, like there's so many like reasons that we're going to have to bring up. It's like one reason's not going to make them change. I think you should be like, say they go to like six months or something, like they're just getting ready. Like they, the, the rep should be the manager, yeah, and then the team yeah. should work together or against each other. <laughs> Even like a team captain, like yeah. they could still play, but like as a team captain, like, I feel like have together, like, like it's really like together the work can happen. Yeah. yeah. Also, like I know that in like Korean culture, whenever I like worked out like a Korean. Like, Wait, the one, Korean, uh, the, like, the teachers go to Korean? No, 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 but I'm just, like, okay, like I'm just as an example, yeah. But, like, sometimes, like, if we had, like, a really good day of working, like, my manager would, like, take us out. She'd be like, it's on me, like, for dinner. Yeah, like, so, like, it's just, like, I, like, respected her because, like, she was doing, like, a kind thing for me. And, like, also, like, I knew that, like, she had more, like, money and, like, power and, like, whatever over me. But at the same time, like... It like kind of like made us closer because like we had time to like outside of the workspace to like actually talk. talk. Yeah. yeah, and I feel like that's like really important because like we don't want to like take completely like strip Kukuti of their like friendly environment and like having the manager. Like, that's friends. good. Yeah, that's really but it's just like we just have to like give them. They have to be more they authoritative. To, they have to know that they have yeah.
<laughs> That's pretty awesome. It's like really convenient when you want to like talk trash about someone, and like they just like don't understand. Yeah, like every time like. But I feel like you get a vibe. Like if someone like you're talking to someone, like, someone next to you, you're talking to another person. I feel like you know they're talking trash about you. You just maybe, you don't but know like exactly what if you hear, if you like ever see me on campus and like I'm with another Korean person and we're talking. Definitely know that I'm talking like crap about someone because like I'm that's what like, you know. Um, yeah, like yesterday. Oh my god, this guy. Oh, I'm taking pictures. He spit on the bus. He literally was like sitting there and he was like, and I was like, are you freaking kidding me? Like you're so like that's disgusting. Like this is not. You're not outdoors. You shouldn't be doing this in your in your home. So like, what makes you think you could do it on a Rutgers bus? Like. Yeah, and like literally, like you just see me like turn around, and I was like, "Are you kidding me?" And then I was with my friends, so I was just like talking about it because I was just like, "That's absolutely disgusting." Like I don't know. And then they knew that I was talking crap about them, right? Like you said, obviously I have this like stink face. <laughs> and then um, he does it again, and I was like, "Ugh, you're so gross." And then they got off the bus, and I was like. Definitely. It's just like so gross though. Like who thinks to spit on a butt? Question, why are there like 20 cups of water? Is it the same thing over and over again? Ew, that's So that you can resell it, they know. <laughs> they know. Are you going to the game? Oh, we're all going to the, well not us, us three. It's my first football game.
like write it out. Yeah. Like, start writing it. I'm like, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Some employees gave suggestions. So okay, so let's see like who's coming or which one of us are going, and then like sit down. Like one person starts. Okay. With the problem, and you like start doing that. Yeah. Okay. I'm just gonna turn off the video yeah, sure. because it's been like. I'm gonna long. open up the Google Doc. Bye. Wave bye.